Hey everyone, I'm finally getting to our second week video of the beautiful puppies. We're starting with Winnie's. So this is Red Ribbon, male. He's just a hunk. Woo! Okay, a little wiggly. Let's see if we could go like this. Football hold. There you go, bud. Oh, it really wants to nurse. Anyway, Red Ribbon. It's turning out magnificently. Look at these big pumpkin heads they're getting. He's really wiggly today. Okay, bud. So we can get his big patchwork. It's like he's got a saddle on. Whoop. There he goes. Let's see if I can get him to hold still. Hey, buddy. There he is. So you can see he's retaining his black and white down his body and he's getting a lot of brown on his face. Okay, sweet boy. Hey, there you go. All right, we'll move on. That was Red Ribbon Mail, Winnie's Litter. And <laughs> look at these guys. Here we have Green Ribbon. And this is, he's gonna be more of like a true try where you're really gonna get a lot of brown in the head where I think Red Ribbon is going to be little bits of brown in the head, but his body is mainly black and white. And this is going to turn... His tongue out. Hey, bud. Hey, it's still kind of sleepy. Are oh, their eyes open? He yeah, he got his tongue back in. Oh, there you go, bud. I think he was still sleeping. Yep. Um, so Green Ribbon, male. <laughs> he's so beautiful. And uh, he's shedding out some of the black. So he's getting um, brown. You can see that in there. Obviously, his head's going to turn totally brown. And I think his shoulders are going to go brown. So again, and you can see little flecks of the brown coming out. Big yawn. Okay, and they're just, he's chunky too. Beautiful boy. Beautiful big white tail. Big white boots on. So that was green ribbon. Okay, all right, and then we're gonna do this big hunky. Okay, and this is my big regal black boy. So, again, he's gonna have total brown head. Love that. This head's gonna totally shut out. Look at the wrinkles, you guys, already. Um, whoo! But he's got a black back. I love that. Little tiny, tiny white tip tail. And just saw the side of him is that white collar. Big yawn. He's got brown on his legs and white boots. He's a looker. Oh I mean, gosh. everybody is. Oh, They're, hold on. Oh, They're trying to play. Little sparring going on down there. So cute. They barely st keep standing. Oh, and wagging tail. Oh, so we're, we're getting little, little signs of life here Come where on. their personalities are coming out. <laughs> so Winnie's litter is two weeks old and three to two weeks and three days today. So just three days older than Delilah's pups. So they're a little bit bigger. Okay. So this is just my solid black boy. He doesn't have a collar on, so we'll just call him solid black. And it's over the years, it's gotten too hard for me to name them, even though I love them to death and pour my heart and soul into this, naming them tears my heart out. So, when you guys pick your puppies, I will start calling them by their names then. But he's my solid black boy, that's how we identify him. <laughs> Long ears too. Okay, next up is... Um, this one is obviously from um, Delilah's litter, so we're going to put him there just for so we can make sure. Now, um, the last, oh yeah, the girl. So a lot of you don't know, but we lost um, the second female. So we just have the one female here, and we know this is Justin and Lacey's dog. So we're so thankful for her. And um, what happens sometimes in Basset Hound litters is the mom, she really acts like a mother hen and she puts the, her little pups underneath her and um, 
it's very possible that she can crush um, them. And so it's a constant vigilance. And uh, the other black female was, um, she was laid on by the mommy, so she didn't make it. But we are thankful for what we have, so we carry on. Anyway, this is beautiful female, big beefy girl. And she's even got some freckles on her back down there. Her head is shedding out to be very brown. And what I love about this litter is um, the variety on the way the tries are turning out. So we've got some that are probably going to retain this true black and white. But then they're a try because their head turns brown. And I just think that is gorgeous. Very gorgeous looking. White tip tail. Let's see if we can get her to yawn. <laughs> there she goes. You can see how much loose skin she's already got on her. Really, all the puppies, they all have this extra loose. And at two weeks, you guys, having all this extra, this is what we produce. These extra saggy, baggy, beautiful babies. So, anyway, she's a special girl. And then lastly, we have our little mascot here. And he is blue collar. And he's not being offered for sale because this is really a runt. This is a runt puppy. Um, doesn't have the same look. But just as precious and just as worthy of life. So we're just going to see how he turns out. Um, yeah, we'll just see how he turns out. He's got beautiful markings too, but he's going to be um, someone that we're not, we're not offering yet. So it's, um, I feel like we're missing someone. <laughs> no, we just have, uh, orange ribbons been playing with them for a bit. So, okay. So this is our sweet little boy, yep. blue collar, who is, we're calling him our mascot. He's staying with us. We'll see how he develops. Yeah. And so, um, since we lost one of the females, um, Winnie has plenty of boobs to handle another, um, what, what do we call that when they, when we, they're like wet nurse? Yeah, wet nurse. There mm -hmm. you go. She's a wet mama. Oh, yeah, wet. <laughs> <laughs> Live video. <laughs> um, so now we'll go to Delilah's pups. Right. Okay, so let me scoot over here a little bit. Okay, so they got brought in from another part of the house. So they're just in a box for now. So we can do the video. They're but warm and toasty. Warm and toasty. Okay, so oh. here we have, this is the male on Delilah's. Oh, I just woke you up, I know. So they are exactly two weeks old today. So they are much more sleepy than the other litter that's a little bit older, three days older. <laughs> it's okay, bud. Let's see if we can get you to calm down. And their eyes are open. So everybody's eyes are open. Delilah's litter and Winnie's litter, their eyes opened pretty much right on schedule, the two week mark, they open their eyes. So this beautiful boy, we gotta put a collar on him. We gotta figure out how to identify him. So um, we're gonna call for, for him. Letter, he's all black. I know, but it's too hard because there's another black boy in okay. that. So I'm gonna put a white collar on him. So Delilah's boy will have a white collar. So, because he's got a white collar right there, but I will actually put a, a Velcro collar on him that's going to be white. Okay, so he's just beautiful. Big, silky, black velvet. And he's going to retain a lot of the black in his head. And he's going to have those, I call them the Groucho Marx eyebrows. Okay, so that's white ribbon, Delilah. Delilah's litter. Okay, then we have the our mahogany. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, come up. All right. It's okay, lovey. It's okay. I know I startle them when I wake them. It's okay. Oh, I know. And you can see the black tips on his um, ears. That might shut out. It might not. We don't know. He's a big boy. He reminds me of our stud um, Mick, who is retired, but Mick is... Delilah's dad. Yes. So this is kind of, I, I feel like this is kind of the Mick legacy coming through. If you guys remember that stud of mine. Beautiful. 
So she really takes after her mom and her grandma, or her grandfather. I mean he, this is a male. Okay, beautiful boy. So I'm sorry you guys, this, this video is really amateur hour for sure because we have just had such lack of sleep. Um, okay, here's Green Ribbon. This is one of the three red and whites. This one's really white, which is so gorgeous, so polar bearish. There are red spots on him. You can see right there. Ears, of course, are going to be um, red. And then this side, he's got even more spots. So this is Green Ribbon Male. Let's see if we can get a good headshot. They all got their that pumpkin head. Gorgeous boy, baby. Okay, so that was Green Ribbon. And we've got Orange, who is nursing off of Winnie's litter. And I think a little bit darker red, for sure. This is gonna be a lot of red. It's almost like just a, a mottled red back there. A little bit more spotting on that side. Big yawn. Oh, the scrunch faces. Beautiful orange. They are sleepy. Okay, so orange, green, mahogany. And then our other third, <laughs> third orange male. He is very truly um, more spotted instead of mottled. So, big red spots. So this is blue ribbon. His eyes open? Mm, not really. Sleepy oh, boys. Eyes open, mouth open. <laughs> you can't break a bee on out. Hi, sweet baby. Come on. Yeah, and they can hear now. They can see a little bit. Get your tail out there. Okay, and then who do we have left here? Yellow ribbon. Yellow. I think, yeah. Okay, so Delilah's puppies were all males. And then our yellow ribbon. Yeah, everybody's males. And chunky boy here. Beautiful regal looking boy with that big um, white, mm -hmm. white blaze. There's the side. So, so sweet. So um, this was yellow. Okay, so what I need from you guys is obviously you're, you can't, you don't have to make your final decision now, but you're really starting to get a good bird's eye view. And let me know what your prefer preferences are. I'm just trying to figure out if there's going to be any red and whites left at the very bottom of the list um, for someone who really wants just a red and white. So. Um, let me know what you're thinking and we start actually making decisions final decisions after the fourth week so the first pick person is jenny and her husband they're actually flying up to pick their puppy in person their number one pick so they're getting here march 13th so we'll know who who number one pick is getting and then i will start notifying everybody with who's been chosen and we'll keep going down the list that way Okay, you guys, happy second week of video. Puppies are doing great. Moms are doing great. Humans are <laughs> wiped, out. wiped out. And um, oh, and another little announcement. I'm going to do a series of videos on how to use the essential oils for your puppies. So, and I'm going to break it down into each video. So it'll be like under three minute videos. So I'll do one video on ear care one video on teeth, one video on fleas, ticks, mosquitoes. So we'll send you that in a little file of a whole bunch of YouTube videos that you can just click on. So I think that'll be way easier for you to learn um, and reference over the lifetime of your dogs growing up. You'll just have me on video. Um, okay, thanks for your trust in us. <laughs> All right. All right, so we'll see you next Friday. Take care.